congratulations on the film. Thank you. Um, I just wanted to know kind of how you first got involved with it, whether you read the script or whether it was just on the basis of the director. Or well, it's um, it started in the classical way, doing audition, and then meeting Jacques, and then he gave me the script, and once I read it, I was hooked. And then I, back then I didn't know I, I would play the part yet. So uh, and then we met uh, a few times more, and we worked together. Um, we had a reading, um, then we had a day of like from from ten to five, just really trying out scenes, improvising, all of that. I had a lot of fun. Some very uh, yeah, there, something very organic happened, and then a couple of, uh, a couple of weeks later. Um, I got a phone call and I was I was extremely excited because I was a fan of uh, Jacques' work way before I ever got involved in this project. And um yeah so I was I was <laughs> I was like a little kid. I was like, "Oh, I can't believe this." He called me him himself and I was like trying to be cool and like, "Oh, okay, thank you, sir." <laughs> you know, and I was yeah, extremely happy. And what was it in the script that really in well, uh, several things. First of all, of course, being able to work with Jacques um, opposite Marion was very exciting in itself. But then um, it was, yeah, of course, it's, it's a screenplay. It's a story about two lost souls connecting on, on some level and engaging in a relationship which is quite hard and difficult and gritty, but at the same time very poetic and to me, there was there was a there was a lot of humor in it as well, um, and it's 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 one of those stories that really gets to you once you once you've read it, and knowing that Jacques would direct it, to me was was very um, yeah I, I felt I was convinced it would be a powerful film because it's a story you can go at it in so many ways and you can you can make it. You can make it a pathetic film as well, or overly dramatic. And with Jacques, I was convinced it, it would be measured and balanced, and 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 that he would be able to strike the right tone. Yeah, because there's some, there's quite a few moments where it could be very melodramatic. Yeah. But it, it kind of reined in more than more than perhaps you'd expect. Yeah. Was that something that you came across in the script, or did you just have that sense from the director? Well, no, in the script. It's 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 the director's choice on how he deals with certain scenes, um, and I was I was really happy Jacques was directing it for that specific reason, knowing that he would approach every scene um, that way that it it would be shot and 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 portrayed in the most sincere way and not in not in this uh, you know this tear jerking um, kind of thing. Um, and you said you did these early audition processes. Yeah. And I assume that kind of bled into rehearsals then as well. Once you knew you had the part. Yeah. Was Marion Cotillard involved in that? Part? Well, I met her once. We had a reading uh, because she was uh, shooting Batman back then. Um, so I mostly rehearsed with Jacques myself and with uh, my kid, the little kid Armand Verdure, which is a extremely adorable little man. Um, so we rehearsed a lot um, by ourselves, just and not rehearsing in a sense to define or, or to really find um, absolute fixed ideas on, on what the character should be. It's just looking for possibilities and, and just trying stuff out and just, and just have a very, um, very loose way of working with one another. And um, it happened very organically. We had a lot of fun. Shock is, is one hell of a guy, yeah. And was there anything uh, kind of surprising that came out of that uh, process? Yeah, well, basically everything. Because everything we rehearsed, we ended up doing something totally different. And that's, and that's what's so wonderful about Jacques. He's, he's truly an artist and looks for life in the instant. So. Maybe in a re rehearsal we did something that he re really liked, but then on set, it's different circumstances, it's a different time, it's a different energy, so we have to go at it again. And that's what I like about him. It's, it's not going back to the past, it's not, no, it's about here and now. So, and so on set, was it very much a kind of 
Bridget sticking to storyboards or as far as you were aware, was there an improvisational element to it? No, Jacques is all about defining uh, the scene in the, in the moment itself. He has really an actor state of mind on set as a director. Of course, he, he knows all about his characters and, and the story he wants to um, the story he wants to shoot. But to him, it's, it's, it's bringing it to life in the instant itself and, and finding all the ways to get there. And what was the hardest uh, thing to film? What was the hardest scene for you to do? Well, the hardest scene, I, I never think of scenes in terms of hard or not. And I realized with Jacques, um, nothing is easy, nothing is, um, because basically you got to shoot every scene as if it's the most important scene of your film. So sometimes you shoot a scene walking in a room and walking out the room again, and you go like, okay, we'll shoot it in a couple of minutes. Yeah, forget about it. Because then you're not considering Jacques. Who, um, <laughs> who deals with it in a very specific way. But of course, there's scenes that obviously are, are more intense, like the, the intimacy scenes between Ali and Stephanie, or, um, or the scene in the hospital. Or, but yeah, I, I don't know. I don't think of it in terms as hard. They're intense, and, they're, and they have to be right, like every scene. It just has, has to be right. So that's what Shock and, and we've been looking for is just try to be the most authentic and, and sincere. Um, yeah. Cool. That's fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you.